Hi guys. So I'm back. So you can only see my fingers today. And I'm not wearing gloves because the last time I did this, when I had the gloves, the, the fish kept sticking to the gloves and I ripped one. So we're gonna start with the bigger bowl first. Can you see? So I already started. I just added one tail. And so what you do is, these are numbered. So one, two, three, can you see? Okay, these are numbered. One, two, three, four, and five. And that's how we're gonna put them down. So I'm, I've never done this before, so we're gonna do this together. So you slightly bend it to pull it off of the thing. And I'm assuming, because it did, the instructions don't tell you some of, I don't know how this goes. I really don't know how this goes, oh my God. So, does it go like this? Oh, I don't wanna mess this up. Oh, I need my, let me go get, let me check my laptop real quick. Oh, where is it? Let's see, before we destroy it, let's see it real quick. Check it out real quick. Sorry, people. But I wanna make sure I'm doing this right. We'll go to orders. You know what, I just ordered these again. So let's go here. And let's click. So luckily they have a picture. So that fin, I don't know. The picture doesn't do me any justice because it doesn't I don't know. So we're gonna wing this, people. We're really gonna wing this because I don't know which way this goes, but we're gonna figure it out. Let's figure it out. So I'm gonna set my laptop right here so I can try to figure this out all right so i got the picture can you all see me okay good i got the picture over there i'm assuming these darker pieces go underneath the face so let's peel it off again and i'm just gonna go with the flow here you got to be very careful when you pull them off because they will rip when i did my first set i ripped it and just put it down really nicely. Okay. And so now we're going to do three. And I hope I have enough space to do this. So let's see. We'll do three. We'll kind of curve him. Kind of, okay. We'll curve him like this. Can you all see? Okay. So we'll curve him. At this, I hope this comes out right. This looks so weird right here. But it does have that in the picture though. And then we do it again. So the way the instructions say you're supposed to layer it, I don't wanna do that. And then we do the last piece. And for this one, because it's so big, I'm gonna do two fish, two koi fish in here. Oh, that 
turned out really pretty, right? Oh, and it looks just like the picture. Okay, so now I'm gonna add this fish in. So we're gonna go, I hope you can see this. We're gonna go one, two, three, four. So we'll put him starting this way. see okay good because I have the camera flipped the other way which is probably not a good thing to do yes this is ladies and gentlemen this is when you my cool crafting people you have to be very careful and the cool thing about it is you line the eyes with the eyes and you just build on top of it it's really really easy and a little true fact. Wanna hear a true story? Okay, true story. Y'all say yeah, okay, great. So true story is that I started dabbling first into acrylic paint because when the pandemic hit, I went through a really bad state of depression, if that's such a thing, if I'm saying that correctly. And it was, it was bad, y'all, it was bad. I was in a really dark place. And so, um, I guess the Lord had other plans. He was like, no, not my child, not my child. And so then, then I started, um, I started, first it started with acrylic, acrylic uh, paint, and then I started doing resin. Not necessarily, I think I started out making jewelry and then I got bored with that. I got bored with that and, ooh, are these all the flowers I have? Oh, jeez. We need to be frugal with these flowers, Miss Nixon. So I'm gonna put one in here. I don't think, uh, I don't think, I hope that fish will fit. If not, we might only be able to do one today. Let's put a little flower right. Let's put it right there. So I'll put her right there. See a little flower? I'll put her right there. And I just ordered some more today, so hopefully they'll either come tomorrow because it's before three o'clock or they will come. Um, no, he is pretty. Or either they'll come Friday. I think I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna put one because there's a bubble right there. So I think I wanna put a plant over that bubble. Let's do a big one. Oh, that's bigger than I expected, which is even better. So we'll do it like this. Look at that. Cute, right? And I feel like I need like something. I'm gonna do a small one. And do like one leaf over here. Okay, I gotta use all these up. Now you gotta figure out the pricing. Well, no knows. Okay, so she's done. You see her? So what we'll do next, or well, final before I leave the studio, is we will we will add the resin on top. So now let's do the let's do this one. Can you all see? Let's do this one. So you always start from one thing about this. You always start from left to right. You build from left to right. I had some, I had a white fish. I think the white might look better. Yeah, I'm gonna do the white for this one. So you start from. Right to left. And I guess it really doesn't matter how you put him.
And this squeegee tweezer thing, I don't use for anything. As a matter of fact, I just opened it when I started this. And you can kind of sort of tell from right here. See right there? Where, can you see the tip of the nose right there? That's how you can tell where you need to line everything up. Maybe the next time I'll do this, I'll follow the directions, <laughs> which is when you do it layer by layer. But if you do that, that's like four or five days. Like, oh, I ain't got time for all that. If you want me to lay resin down. Oh, that's pretty. He pretty, right? So you squish him down, squish him, push him, squish him, push him to make sure that he's all the way down in the resin. I'm gonna add a little flower right. Let's put her right here. So there's a second one. Oh, they look real right. Don't they look real? They look real right. That's the second one. And then let's do this little puppy. So for this one, as you see, I already added a flower right here. Um, Maybe I should stand up so I can see the camera. Yeah, let's do that. This works better when you stand up. So as you can see, I have a little flower right there. So because this is really small, so hopefully I can't use anything that really fans out like this little puppy bear. See, that would be too wide. That's trash. Oh, wait a minute. What about this he fit? I don't want to put him in there because he might, he looked like he might be squished. Let's try. I think I'm going to go with this one. This looks demonic. Does it look demonic like it's not fully grown or something? Does it go with something else? Let me check the picture. Hold on, y'all. I think he goes with this. What does he go with? Does he go with this? Ooh, I don't wanna. So you do bam, 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 bam. He's not on here. Hold on. He's not on the pictures. Nope. And they all have numbers. This is, let me see if there's another, another page. Let's see, I don't see 001 or three. Hold on. Oh, there's more. Oh, so that's the way he's supposed to look. That's weird. Oh, oh, one is it looks like that. That's how they did it. So we're using oh, oh, one people. So hopefully I can do this standing up because that way I can look in the camera, which is above and see what you all see to make sure you can see. So let's take this puppy off. I know you're saying, oh my God, why is she calling puppies in their fish? I call everything that's smaller than me a puppy, except for people, I don't call them. Once she down, she down, you can't pull it back up. So I like to stick her to my finger so I can reposition her and pull her up. Oh my God, y'all. Look at my dry hands. Do you think that 
show work. <laughs> Take them up. Can we take both? Oh yeah. Oh, let's pull one up one at a time. One at a time, Nixon. One at a time. Let's move her up. So we'll sit her here, and then we'll take her up. Oh. Uh oh, y'all. Don't rip, don't rip, don't rip, don't rip. Don't rip, don't rip, don't rip, don't rip. Remember that song? Don't rush. All right, so we're gonna move her a little bit. More up, more up. There we go. Move her up. So maybe we put him down. I'm such a perfectionist, you all. Much better, right? She don't look the fool though. Look at her. Now I see why they say you should do the layers because you build up. Maybe that gives you the three. I don't know. I'm not one of them following directions anyway. So I'm going to pause. I'm not going to pause. So what we did, so let me show you. I'm not going to show you why. I'm not going to let you see me pour wood resin on it because we all know how to do that. So this is one with the little flowers. I added that, right? This is a spoon rest I got from Marshalls for, um, these were in clearance. So this is what I talked about in part one. My video, be careful. Oops. Be careful when you pour your resin so that you don't get it on the sides. I think I did good with this one. It's not on the sides, see? Okay. And I think this is my, my, my new, my, 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 I can't even talk, my new fade. So we'll pour resin over top of this and we'll be done. And I did good with not getting any on the sides. My Nautica, see? My Nautica bowl. And I found this in clearance. I like to shop at um, Ross, TJ Maxx, definitely Marshalls, because they have the best clearance stuff. And then I have some other bowls. So when my, I just ordered some more fish. So when they come, they have fish that are really slender. I'm gonna use that for this. And then, um, we'll do some in these as well. These will really be, like, for these, I'm really going to go really deep. Like, I'll put some sea moss in the bottom and then some black and white stones in the, some black and white stones in these stones as well. So, I didn't add these this time, but I probably will add them when I do these pads. I mean, these rolls. And I'll probably put one in here, just to brighten up a little bit. But these are the ones that I used and the ones that I just showed you. And these came from Michael's. Either No, they, they either came from, my, yeah, $3.99, they came from Michael's. Or um, either, oh, probably Hobby Lobby. Yep. So that's it. That's the video, I promise you all. Thank you all for stopping by. I will be posting on the CK Showroom website 
the bowls once they're done they will be ready for purchase and hopefully going to a new home soon but thanks for stopping by thanks for learning with me And then when I do this video, I'll do another video with the final images uploaded. Okay. Bye.